Hi, I'm going to be talking about how they can do without you. Someone told me only yesterday how her former boss once told her that the minute you start a new job, begin planning for someone to put you out of that job. Essentially, accept the foundational truth that you are not indispensable. Some call it succession planning. And according to PMB Paribas, Wealth Management Strategies, we should think of succession planning as a process and not an event. The earlier we start, the better. Admittedly, many put off succession planning due to the unconscious sentiment that only they can do the work to a specific standard. That is both unsustainable and untrue. As the saying goes, there are many ways to skin a cat, though I'm not sure why anyone would want to skin a cat in the first place. Your successor may not be you, and neither do they have to be, since there were many before you, and there will be many after you. I speak from experience. I can be a bit of a perfectionist, and I find it difficult to delegate since no one can do the work the way I want it done. But I've learned that when you cannot be there, and believe it or not, you, can, you can't always be there, life goes on. Wouldn't it be gratifying, much more gratifying, if the inevitable progression bore the hallmarks of your supervision or your investment. So begin now to shore up for tomorrow. Begin to delegate, to stand back and to let others make mistakes under your supervision. The earlier, the better. My name is Ekene Ezeji and this is my couch piece for today.